this is actually watchable and enjoyable, unlike last year. Hey, what was wrong with last year? I felt like during our 10 game loss streak, at some point it became, it went from sad into back to being funny. Like first it was great and then it was so depressing, but it's, it got so depressing. It ended up being a comedy. We lost to John Cutie last year. Yeah, it's no fair. We had to play against John Cutie as our first match. Okay. This guy turned mid Sentinels into world champions. We never stood a chance. Like for all of last year in NA, you had top dogs like NRG, and then you had the two m clouded mid tier teams, Sentinels and 100 Thieves. And now Sentinels is good. Imagine if you had Demon 1 and John Cutie. It's funny you say that because when I was initially building my team, John Cutie was the one person I reached out to. Just imagine if I sent that message a month earlier, what could have been? Just imagine if we didn't scrim D uh, EG that day with Demon 1 on the team, what could have been? November 1st, 2022. Hey there, I wanted to ask what your current status is in pro play. And we're going to find a team for a tier 2 Valorant. Who's available? I'm like, I gotta say, I, 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 I gotta say, I'm a pretty good talent scout. We were trialing Demon 1. I messaged John Cutie. I should be building teams, man. 